thanks for joining me again guys for another video uh, this is a retro review I want to do with uh, a VHS uh, Starcade 1999 held December 19th 1999 the battle to end the millennium so there's an 18 certificate this is the one where uh, Bret Hart got that concussion that ended his career against uh, Spearboy Goldberg There's the spine Warner Brothers release Yeah, so yeah, it's a bit damaged at the top. I've got to replace this case somehow I Dropped it and freaking broke it. So we got a uh, Starcade features the last heavyweight title bout of the millennium and it marks a shocking new beginning for WCW, Goldberg and Bret Hart, two of the most esteemed grapplers in wrestling, square off for the championship gold. Former enemies and former tag team partners, they enter the ring with mutual respect. And they didn't end with mutual respect, did they? <laughs> Sorry. A fair test of their legendary skills is all they expect. But a radical decision by a surprise official shocks wrestling fans everywhere, setting the wheels in motion for the return of the dreaded NWO. Of course, this is the build. Excuse me. This is the build up to the uh, the NWO with Bret Hart in. So we had a U.S. title ladder match with Chris Benoit against Jeff Jarrett, which was really badass. I loved that match. Very good. Uh, powerbomb match Kevin Nash versus Sid Vicious which was a bit random Crowbar and a pole match that's even more random DDP against David Flair Sting versus uh, the total pa package Lex Luger with Liz on his side won't spoil the outcome for that if you haven't seen it not a great match to be honest but it's the way it is and then we've got a battle of the sexes, Medusa versus Evan Courageous with Spice. And I think that was for the Cruiserweight Championship, if I remember rightly. And it says, like, uh, plus six more unbelievable encounters. And that included uh, Big Vito and Johnny the Bull, known as the Mama Lukes back then, against Disco Inferno and Lash LaRue in a tag match. That was shit. An entertaining match was Meng versus Norman Smiley for the Hardcore, hardcore Championship. Uh, Revolution, which was like Shane Douglas, Perry Saturn. Who, who was the other one? Dean Malenko, I think it was. Uh, they were against Jim Duggan and the Varsity Club. That was a shit match. Vampiro against Dr. Death Steve Williams. That was an okay match. Uh, Creative Control, which was the Harris Brothers, if I remember rightly. And Kurt Hennig against Harlem Heat and Midnight. And then Jeff Jarrett working double duty on this pay-per-view. He was against uh, Dustin Rhodes in a bunkhouse brawl match. So as I said, it was an 18 certificate. 162 minute run time. There's the tape. Not a fake. I don't do fakes. <laughs> but yeah. Overall, I give this uh, pay-per-view 6.5 out of 10 my opinion um obviously i've watched better starcades than this the uh the main event was a bit of a letdown it, it looked good on paper bret hart against goldberg it's like a dream match but nah definitely not well thanks for joining me guys for my opinion and that i um, hope you like this review please feel free to like subscribe and comment I always like to hear your feedback. It means a lot to me. Take care of yourselves and peace.